Facebook, YouTube, what is up guys? Today is June the 13th. We're out here in the Cummings, Georgia area. I actually came out here about three months ago. This is a new client, Mr. and Mrs. McGee, Andrew and Liz. They actually found me on YouTube. Uh, there's, I think that's the guys. Well, anyway, they actually found me on YouTube. Very impressed with my videos. So I came out here about three months ago when they first bought this house, but they've been doing a lot of reconstruction here. And show you guys what we're going to be doing today. We're going to be doing 1,536 square feet of uh, screen and recope. Actually, shout out to Kevin. He actually came yesterday and also cleaned the air ducts. And then once they get all this stuff removed off these uh, off this deck, they're also going to have me come back and screen and recoat the deck. But let's just show you guys what we're doing today. So these are some floors, guys. He said, Courtney, we was thinking about replacing these floors, but after we got some quotes. It was totally, totally out the ballpark. So again, they went on YouTube, watched my videos. I came out here. They was very excited to have me out here. Came out here, gave them a quote, did the measurements, and then um, they, he, he actually booked uh, his estimate uh, consultation the next day. So I'm with three months later. This is what we're, we're doing. So guys, as you can see, this floor really is just worn out. Um, show you guys what I'm going to, what we're going to be doing. This area, pretty nice size home. Uh, so you can see they had the whole kitchen remodeled. Um, this area right here. Okay. And then this area right here. So really with this floor, the original finish is just worn off. Also, we're going with a satin finish. This area right here. Come on down. You see like right here, see I just kind of worn. It's gonna look so good when we're done. This area right here. They got some new floors right here, so we're gonna stop here. That's actually luxury vinyl plank floors. And then this area right here, all right? So that's what we're gonna do, guys. So I'm gonna go ahead and start bringing in the equipment. Uh, Kevin and Scoby uh, are actually headed this way. And like I said yesterday, uh, we also offer air duct cleaning. And most of our air duct cleaning jobs do come from when we uh, do the floor. So Kevin did the air ducts yesterday. So anyway, guys, go ahead and get started. Come back and show you some results. Stay tuned. This hallway and this hallway. All right, guys, I am done with the screening. Uh, Kevin is backing me, and then Scobie's coming right behind Kevin with the clean and tacking. Guys, one thing, again, you hear me talk about it in my videos a lot. One thing I love about clean and tacking our floors, it gives us a good indication uh, how the floors are gonna look when we put that poly down. So you can see this is the area that Scobie has clean and tacked using the clean and prep system. Um, see, he's clean and tacking here. All right, so we got a great abrasion on this floor. So clean and tacking is one of the things that we like to do. I do see a lot of guys, you know, across the uh, internet uh, when they do buffing coats, they do not clean and tack. But again, guys, everybody's different, but this is something that we like to do because not only does it show us how the floors are gonna look when we're putting the poly, also it'll show us if we have to do any type of color correction, but also just give the floors a nice, good cleaning before putting that poly down. So you can see Scoby uh, is cleaning. That is looking good, guys. This floor is gonna look amazing when we're done. This is why we highly recommend it. What we're gonna do, I took a piece of the pad that was left, um, black scrubbing pad, and under here, under the stove, we're gonna uh, do that by hand. And again, Kevin is vacuuming, getting up all the uh, loose debris. All right, guys. Uh, one thing I lost, this, this, is so, this, this house is so unique. 
that uh, when I first came, I was kind of confused, but that's the front door. When you come in, this is the pool area. The pool sits right in the middle of the house. And that is like, I've never seen nothing like this, but it's like you can come from the kitchen, <laughs> jump in the pool. You can come from the living room, jump in the pool. You can come in the front door and jump in the pool. Or you can come from the master's home and jump in the pool. So uh, that's, that's really unique, guys. All right, guys, stay tuned. All right, guys, we got the first coat going down. Remember, this is a satin finish. No matter what sheen you put down, it's always going to be uh, have that high gloss wet look because the water is still in the finish until it ev evaporates. So this is a satin finish. So we're just getting started with the first coat. Um, since we don't have to leave, I just ordered me and the guys some DoorDash. Um, so we'll have lunch while the first coat is drying. And then I'll come back and show you guys some results. Stay tuned. all right guys check it out first coat ready for the second coat man look how much better and man this floor just came out amazing but you know again guys we do this every single day so we already knew the outcome but we're still happy just to see the outcome man just bring your hardwood floors back to life i just I just enjoy it, man. I just enjoy it. Uh, actually, the missus of the house, Miss Liz, she actually came up and looked at it. And she said, oh, my God, Courtney, looks like a brand new floor. And they actually was thinking about replacing this floor. Um, so that's a good thing that they didn't. Uh, but overall, guys, man, floors came out amazing. This is just the first coat. So what I'm going to do, guys, I'm just getting the last video. I'm going to let Scobie, Kevin, take care of the second coat. I'm going to go off and do a few consultations. Uh, one is actually here in Cummings, and then the other one's back in Lawrenceville, uh, where, you know, where we are based out of. But man, these floors came out amazing. Check it out, guys. Check it out. Yes. Wow. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. And again, this floor, um, it is a, uh, a, it's actually a hand scraped solid floor. This is not engineered, manufacturer made. This is a uh, hand scraped. Uh, it is a pre-finished floor, Brazilian cherry, um, but it was urethane. It did not have aluminum oxide on it, uh, as you can see in the video. So overall, guys, um, that's going to do it. Uh, actually, the client already made the payment, um, and she went back downstairs, went back to work. You know what's weird, though? Um, you see that circle? Look at this, guys. It goes, look at this. It actually goes into the closet, and I'm like, how did that happen? Because usually that would be a rug, but it's impossible to lay a rug with a wall there. So I don't know if this was like an additional build, but I just know I noticed that part, but I just noticed this part after the first coat. So I guess it was a that wall was in there at one time. So uh all right, guys. Well, that's going to do it. Uh, tomorrow, I will be out all day tomorrow doing consultations. I actually have four to do tomorrow. i um, be back at it Thursday, Friday, Saturday. See you guys in the next one. Oh, man, the sound of that pool just makes me want to jump in. Um, but we'll see you guys in the next one. And like I said, I'm going to let Kevin and uh, Scobie uh, take care of the next coat. All right, guys. See you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Wow, nice, nice.